Well, this is a haven for talented kids. In hands, that is. Ken Ulmers found the creative craft work road trip in, in Biltmore Village today. So many unique creations in one space, people are literally covered in craft work. At the Southern Highland Craft Gallery, Joanne, thanks for having us in. Thank you for coming back. So how many craftspeople have their work on display and for sale here? We have about 130 artists here out of a guild of almost a thousand. And it really runs the gamut. Talk about the different types of craft work you'll find. Well, we have wood, clay, glass, jewelry. We have some wonderful jewelers here at our shop. Even wearable. Even wearable. Arts, wearable <laughs> crafts work. Who are you wearing? I am wearing Jen Swearington, one of her new pieces. And people are drawn to so many different things you see in the window, including the doggy in the window. The doggy in the window gets a lot of attention. Yes, he does. And baskets made of kudzu. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Who would have thought? You just passed your first anniversary in this beautiful historic spot. Remind me what this used to be. This was a bank. It opened as a bank in 1928 and closed a little while after that. Yeah, there's a little bit of trouble yeah, in the late trouble. 20s with the banking industry. So you've almost outlasted the bank. Congratulations <laughs> with that. You. Of course, the big craft fair of the Southern Highlands is going to be at the U.S. Cellular Center mm -hmm. downtown come October. Right. But you are here year round. We are here every day. Some great pieces to thank see you. and add it to your home. Joanne, thank you so much. Thank you, Kim. you can find out much more about the Southern Highland Craft Gallery from the Road Trip and Link at WLOS.com. Road Trip and in Biltmore Village, I'm Count Ulmer.